The weirdest group of people I've seen in recent time on social media, especially <laughs> Facebook, is Zola and his friend Felix. <laughs> it is so crazy and intense. I don't know if it's, it is my post, the target to come and misbehave. But today I'm sitting here with Zola and I want to ask, why? Sad John Boy, you can't Seriously, because yeah, because I don't know, I don't even know that one. No, no, seriously, oh, sorry, I'm sure no, yeah. he's one ugly boy. Yeah. I think a person tapping on oh, her friend, I'm a person tapping a crap. Yeah, but but he's, he's not using the right channel. Nah, I'm sure tell me to me that kind of boy, if a friend me, oh, Zola, please let me follow you, let me be your boy. boy. Tell <laughs> The way you are saying that thing, it's, it's clear that if people you have some cool vibe going on because I don't know what somebody you are uh, beefing can, with will do. It's, it's it's like I can't be cool with an ugly boy like Ferris. <laughs> no, he's too ugly. If you are looking for the meaning of ugly and you don't find it in the dictionary, just replace that side with Felix. He's too ugly. Channel book crap. Wow. Felix, this part, I did it for you. So I'll cut it. People can fight your final <laughs> fight. And once I post and you fight, do not comment on my post again. Including I you. Can't, I can't fight with the chimpanzee. <laughs> hey, God. I'm moving. Yeah. Please, you're yeah, welcome to the fan zone. I am Tilly K. And I'm sitting here with Zola. Zola has started a fight on social media. I brought it here. And apparently, I'm sure the guy will say I should grant him a special interview to also come and say so. But that won't happen. No, like I'll be very happy because he has never posted his picture before. <laughs> oh, come in the Hey. Oh, come in the I see. Okay. So, as you know, fan zone, you are the star. What you're saying to your stars is what we put premium on. Now, we have two videos here that we are going to talk about. Shatawale featuring medical. So, be afraid. Mm -hmm. Be afraid was what the, the song that was supposed to pick predict or show their life in jail and those kind of things so some of the comments some of you put on the video we'll talk about that and then we have of his afro high life ep kwame yuji it's a really cool song really really cool so here are some comments for tinafia let's start with tinafia by the way what do you think about the song no the song is perfectly done um production from production to delivery to whatever to video to everything was on point as you are Ghanaians will start pointing out some accusations and other stuff but the song is a perfect song and then you know an artist under links entertainment they will not even get certain things wrong so with that song Tinafi and then the video perfect concept okay so this person here is Austin Church Austin Church is saying that great tune always. I love the fact that Kwame Eugen is holding the touch of high life high. Great inspiration from Obibini Techis, Akoso Bokania, and mm -hmm. Jordakos Ako Tibra for high life forever. Yes. Was it necessary for him to point? Also, I wanted to subtle. Some kind of subtle. Yeah, I said, subtly. No, but see, it's good. So I point out this things because <clears throat> a whole lot of people are. Or more chastising Kwame Eugene for sampling, or maybe say, what could we are beat and I've been might not even know the right owners of those in your mumpo now. But a lot of people are ignorant on social media ranting, come on, Kasak, big, 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 they don't even know the owners of the right owners of these songs, they don't even do much more research before even coming out on social media. So, with the guy pointing out this thing, fine, in as much as it looks, say, be our person or play some diabolic way in the crown, what educate. Those lame people no more social media now. They, they just, just be talk in here. Yeah, yeah. So tell it it's it, 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 it on point. Let's talk about Kwame Eugene holding the torch of high life high. The last time I had an interview with Kwame Eugene, I said as a high life from Major Born on Kwanaso. But what he's saying has he over the years portrayed that as a no one will push high life no more. You see, um I would have felt bad if a car say and you know who push high life. Yeah. Yes, because and not to mean say he's the only one doing it certain all kind but at the end of the day he has to because already in a way say a crown as high life king so he has to take that mantle because there are so many high life songs i echo kofi kinata has great high life songs so many high life songs be brave that you see i like it say or then we see as a young guy mm -hmm. he's championing that cause because 
you are targeting her life to be some kind of uncrafonium. So this is a time that Kwame Eugene is also trying to bring the youth to love the song High Life Beat and also put the name of Ghana music high because we are noted for High Life. Ghana didn't say, you have to with any idea. Any idea. Afro beat is fused of certain elements from our High Life Niamana. You will be shocked if this Nigerian artist and I say, I am foreign artists come to Ghana and then they want us to... But you know if you go on Apple Music, the category definition for Afrobeat is song that originates from Nigeria and Ghana. Because, do you know why? Because a draw song, it dominates. If if her life should dominate, you'll say, you know, like, and then we've got so many artists championing it. When they are even submitting their songs to these digital stores, they put it like, Jenna no Honum as her life. Uh, in the same way, you know, that kind of thing in Honum. For now, Afrobeat and High Life is being attributed to this Nigerian because almost more you have Afrobeat anymore. And then we share elements of Afrobeat. We have a little bit of High Life because this Afrobeat you know, was stolen from High Life music. They just um, removed and added certain elements to name it Afrobeat. Asa? Okay. So this, this um, Austin Church has a point. Yeah, he yeah, has a point. Let's move to the next comment on this same thing. If it, she's called Claudia Nyame. Claudia Nyame is saying that our mommies and daddies will get something to dance to this X Max. Our grannies will dance to this tune. Good job, Dan. The songs that have been coming. I am paying for one pana. Okay, so I mean, I've gotten a chance to sit with so many elderly people, and then what they keep saying is, "I nasi nyuma mbori ngo si anyumu ngo anasi." Yes, ngo si anyumu. To seven. Sebio, Kasiani, Mukuanya, Sabia, and him as Munka, Simbia, but you see, comment here this particular person has made one because of the beat. The old man sitting in one village, Wali Wali, in Wali Wali or Wa or somewhere or Tumu or somewhere, who, at a, when the, that old man hears the beat, you'll be like, okay, let me listen to. No, but Kai, the time, no. Okay, so let me listen to this. Okay, oh yeah, yeah, comes Rockstar and they listen to the lyrics. And, okay, then now. The youth now are also doing something reasonable. But we've been doing something with that, like year after year or okay, so decade after decade. No, you see, we have been we have so many good songs in our system. But this is the case that the so-called foolish songs get the trends more than the good songs. Come on, we've got so many good songs. But check for the for the past five years. Check in your money, I make you with here, you know. Oh, check the, no, check that. See, 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 let me tell you something. I am the same person I know that I keep saying, say, who determines a good song? It's only the consumers that determines good song. No, not Ghana here. Ghanaian consumers, they don't even know what is a good song. They uh -huh. so, song no, but you see, but you see, but you see, they still determine what a good song is because the moment that Makotsana club, Manum, Sana, my high, you know, if you want to hear a beat, keke, pampana, pampana, at that very moment, you know. The moment that that kind beat need to be moving my son, I will say that that beat is the, uh, is the best song in the world. And that's say, at that same, uh, that guy is one no more son. If you go and play, excuse me, say, Akwabwa song, eh, Akwabwa maybe this kind of love song, you even, might even walk to the DJ and even slap the DJ, say, Ankwasi, I don't an album. Yeah. You understand? But this same person can also sit in his comfort zone when he is not under any alcohol, alcoholic influence, and then might be like, Oh, you see, I call you, I call you, like Italian, you know, just the dopest song that, but you know, some of that same beat, you know, all kind of clubs are best, you know, some of the same thing. I'm gonna say, Ah, now, why isn't a bunk? So sometimes the consumer determines what the good song is. Okay, well, we'll take a quick break and we jump on to the next song, we do not go anywhere. Charlie, what's up, guys? It's your boy Kojo Q. I'm here, one play Africa, one year. You know, you know what it is already. We are putting it down. Make sure you stick and stay all the time. The best is even yet to come, but you know we are better than everybody else. Welcome back to the fan zone. We just discussed Kwame Eugene's Tinefia music video. Now we are moving on to Shatawale and Medical. Now this song, Be Afraid. When I checked on Shatawale's official page. On YouTube it is just a promo of the video that is out but there's a page on Twitter uh, on YouTube called gold app that has the official video you know when people actually put various videos together just to create a, an illusion of 
a music video or one on and sing cake. Okay. As I, I found old women, I put it together okay. just to make you feel like, but this one, it is a proper shoot, the, the shoot that they shot, and a full song out and all of that. So I want to say maybe this, most of us, uh, I think, Vivo or... So you know this video, You Alone, by Miss V. It was Trace that actually did it. So the video, when the video came out fresh, not a me. Miss Fee page, now we'll trace full mm. page. So I don't know, say if it's the same deal these two ads because you know in recent times they have a lot of bars. So you won't be it won't be so surprising for somebody to say, you know what, well, let me finance mm. your soul together right from jail. Do you get this? I don't know if that is what's happening. So so if something like this happened, it has to be properly announced. Announced before even that video goes on that channel. Because one fans of Shatawali, fans of Medica. If the song is Shatawali featuring Medica, fans of Shatawali would be expecting the song on Shatawali's page, page or medical speech. medical speech. Not in the yes. era that fans are fight, always fighting of views, one million views and the rest. Uh -huh. So see, if that channel gets one million views within two days or within a week, mm -hmm. who is going to take their credit? Mm -hmm. okay. So certain things needs to be properly done. Oh, okay. It needs to be properly done. I'll say management. That's now okay. You finance the video. What are the documents behind these things? What are the you understand? What kind of PR will be a formula? We will say the two PR plans. We will say the two answer. These videos might even. Go I mean, out. for now we are just speculating that that is why it is. But the video is out, right? On a different page. Yeah, it's a full video. So, out. so that's what I'm saying. Say. That's what I'm saying. Say. Uh -huh. A full video is out on a different page, unknown to a whole lot of people. Okay. You understand? So what do you do? The team, these two are these two teams together or three teams together. Eh, the page with the video ago, mm -hmm. be afraid remix produced by Gold App. Okay, this is the let me read it this way so you all get uh, what is going on exactly mm -hmm. what's happening here. It's a trending number one on YouTube music. Mm -hmm. So Chatawale featuring Medical Be Afraid Remix produced by Gold App and Marcus Records official video. Mm -hmm. So that is it. Okay, so now let's go to what, what we are here for. That's the fan zone part of the conversation. Mm -hmm. And then we have the first comment here from Ali Awudu. Ali Awudu is saying that the reason why I like this guy Shatawale is that he has so many different ways to approach any situation. What is so different from what Shatawale has been doing? Because anytime Shatawale gets in trouble, he drops a music to, you know, get his song, I mean, get his hit. What is so different? Which uh, is he talking about? I like, I like the question you just... <laughs> It's true now too because um I like the question in the sense that I'm trying to even figure out if this guy started following Shatawale just yesterday. <laughs> oh my god. No, yeah, because Shatawale has always been someone who capitalized on certain set, certain mistakes or certain uh misunderstandings. Misunderstandings or situations. We won't say BB training panel of a boy. There was a time Stoneboy uh, I think it was it Stoneboy or something like that. There was an issue around and then um there was a comfortable list something i think a social media trend or something like that vote or something and then stoneboy or maybe one person from other camp wrote comfortable lead the next moment we saw shatawale and the militant brought up a song in a line with a line silently oh, with that she will try to no you back you see Go, you understand hey, so shatawale has been that person uh, even if there are trends and then a name comes out he will try to point something around it yeah, 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 what would be the name? There will be so many songs. Yeah, if he, anytime he has a brush with somebody or a misunderstanding. Yeah. Say that, uh, uh, with say fee, and then all that things, WMT, and then all those things. So, sax, sax on, and for the Kimi. The next time, no, for Pim, so yes. <laughs> I, I don't really know what this yes. guy is saying. So, he's that smart guy that will always capitalize on the little chance he gets. So, this guy, um, I don't even know if. He just started following Shatawali's music or Shatawali's brand. You should at least, at least do more research before putting on certain comments. Not to hear him say, okay, because I'm an SM fan, I will just say everything that. No, at least. Yeah. Then you see, you know, we correct SM fan. Because yeah. correct yeah. SM fan will not say, nah, this one. Yeah, well, yeah. Shat Shat that they're in there. If you see the word Z sub, they train, you could do some title Z. Shut up, they He's too smart in that. Okay, so this person here too is saying that she's, he's called Chingi Kwesi Jr. Chingi Kwesi Jr. I said, this video says a lot, a lot, a lot, man. 
let me tell you what I'm a from here. When you see how she was school, this video says a lot, man. You could see him asking the camera guy to follow him to prison from living on the street. He is literally sending a message across about our unimaginable poor prison system. Do not live a reckless life and end up in jail regardless. Uh, you see, I like what these two aunts are doing. Uh, with them trying to advocate against the freedom, your right not to even end up in jail. End up in jail and stuff. But you see, um, um, this video talks a lot about it. And then with what they are even doing on their social media and those with a couple of interviews that they've granted, looks good. With this, what this guy is saying, looks good. But you see, it's up to us, the individual, who or who doesn't know that pre the prison yard there is not even attractive for you, you as a human being. We've seen so many videos of these prisoners come out and they narrate the kind of stress they go through, the kind of evil things they go through there. You understand? Shatter and Co knew about this. Even if they didn't know, they, they've heard stories. I stand to be corrected though. They heard stories that prison, Honomono, is not a good place for you to live. You understand? So, you know, they are doing a good thing. The fans and also students be so reluctant to be like, no, because of this thing, I just have to abstain from some stupid behaviors. I be able to end me up behind bars or behind, end me up at that yard, prison yard. Because, Honomono, Charlie. Even though you've not even slept there before, even when you watch movies, that alone is hey, too. Even, please, Abuche movie, yeah, the, the, that place is heavy. That's compared to no, but other places. So. Abuche movie is uh, 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 more than more or less like a heaven compared to Ghana. Yeah. yeah. Still, we watch Ghanaian movies in Marco prison. Uh, Charlie, from the days of G-Man, Jaga P, they've been into prison before. They've narrated this their stories about Charlie the prison yard the and yeah. Atai, we've heard stories of Atai, his story life in prison in Yamana. We've heard people are uh, and NGOs have gone. So what there. are you saying? That they shouldn't have no. gone to jail first before they come and tell the story. Like they should have listened to exactly. stories and then advised people rather than Ex exactly. always trying to be a scapegoat in What are you saying? Uh, no, but saying? okay, so I'm trying to let the fan and then Shata and Co. Because Shata and Medica are trying to portray that kind of thing that prison honeymoon yeah. And my year more, so we shouldn't sell our freedom and then go and stay in that yard. Fine, but I'm saying that you see, we are Ghanaians. You may be in China never be in two years before we start advocating for certain things, okay? Because we've heard, we've watched movies, short videos on social media, and everything. We've heard or maybe seen documentaries of ex convicts narrating the kind of stress they went through out there. You understand? Shaka is a street boy. He might have even had boys in his camp. Yeah? And our boys, he might know now. They've oh, gone to prison before. Ah, they know say, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So we shouldn't be that relaxed and feel like, oh, I know people. This day I go feel good. Because we've got so many people now. Even Mudim Kwasasema, they feel like, you and me, I go go prison. I go go this. What the Shatawali say the first day they went to God? I want to fucking write in jail. I get you. But here he is advising. You understand? So we shouldn't wait for certain uh we better to answer. We come advise it. So Charlie. Okay, I know we've had a fruitful conversation. Please, if you are watching today is your first time. We you are not usually like this. We don't we don't say insult raw like that. You just use the F word raw. We don't do that. Today it's me and him, so I mean it's raining and everyone is everywhere is wet, so we all need heat. Yeah. Okay. All right, so then we will end here. Zola, drop your social media handles and let's move. Zola near on all platforms. Live news DH on all platforms. Be beer. Okay, one play Africa on all social media platforms. Now, are you aware that one play plus is active on our website? So once you go on oneplayafrica.com, it's not about news. Go and watch our products, our productions. They are so cool. We just uploaded a video with Joe Boy. Can't get you, Charlie. Hey, you be a hard guy. Yeah, Can't yeah, get yeah. you a guy. But the <laughs> video is top notch conversations. Industry, if you're an artist, you're doing Afrobeats. This interview is for you because Joe Boy is a front liner. I've seen you posting it, but you're not even giving me credit. But you're also, not giving me credit. I'm not. Me train so about my video. Let me get more of But Charlie, may I talk one thing? 
I've seen you guys advertising some pretty and windy. Yeah, and I'm a Yeah, so, um, yeah, yeah. so um, <laughs> that's one play plus. Go and watch our videos, they are cool content. Now, we have the one play picks, which is talking about one play picks is a gaming or online gaming platform where you that love sports can go and predict your favorite scores. And we are doing this in partnership with Tom Vita and Guy Guy Things. So just go and predict. If you predict correctly, you win some cool Tom Vita briefer. You are the rough. And then you can also win some cool shares from Guy Guy Things. So just go and predict. What is the Serie A? Moko mm. predicted Serie A. Yes, yeah. Moko predicted La Liga. Moko predicted Premier League. Just predict. And please, when you go, Go and read the terms and conditions. Don't go and read and tell us to do you <laughs> convince your award yes, or reward into something. Yes, that's a good video. Yes, read, Charlie. Boy, so I was someone jumping on this thing for me. It's very crucial. No, you go jump on because we are already in that system already. Investors, we are already investing in that space already. Great, great. All right, so please <laughs> go on <laughs> oneplayafrica.com, go to Picks, go to Plus, and go and have a good time. Their website now is for you. Guys, if there's anything you have to do, do it now. One play, one play, one play. Add class to your music.